Creating a background that's going to be used in an animated film or a show means that your painting is not the main attraction. It sits behind the main focus of the audience's attention, which is the characters moving about in the front of the show. The main difference between creating a background for animation and, say, creating a picture of a scene for purely illustration purposes is that a background has to support the story point of that scene. Even the most beautifully painted and illustrative backgrounds don't detract from the main action. And the very best backgrounds enhance the story point and add to the atmosphere or the mood of the film without the audience even realising it. All of this means that you have to consider staging when you're creating a background. Staging in animation is literally how you arrange the elements in a scene for the clearest possible view of the action. The main thing is obviously you've got to give the characters room to move around. That's first and foremost. So, for example, you wouldn't put a huge, bright and distracting background element in the centre, no matter how nice you think it would look there. You also need to be aware of where the characters will enter and exit a scene, and how they'll move about within that scene. To get this kind of information, you have to study the board panel that's been drawn for the scene, and there the board artist will have indicated any screen direction that the animation needs to take. In this panning shot, the characters simply run from screen left into the shot, so all of this area is clear of any elements at all. There's a lot of room for the action to take place in just this part of the screen. In this background of the scientist's lab, there's a big background element in the centre, of course, but the board panel shows that the scientist is going to be situated here, to the left, so I know that the action's going to be taking place down here, and then I can fill out the rest of the frame. Also for the wide shots, there's plenty of room for any action to take place here. Also bear in mind that staging really means how you direct the audience's eye. So in a subtle way, that means a whole lot more than merely giving the animation some room. It means you can think about colour choices, tonality and composition to effectively support the underlying theme of the story or the scene. Another direct way of influencing the audience's attention is to use framing devices. And so I'm going to explain all about framing up next in the next tutorial.